last 15 or 20 years, my biggest question has been, why in the world God keep me, let me keep living? I mean, uh, and ultimately, it came to me, I was still living because I hadn't done my job. And not only hadn't done it, had been knowing all the time what it was. I mean, they, uh, uh, and, and only letting my own ego stand in the way. Thinking maybe people are gonna think, you know, they've been saying Jane Merritt is crazy all my life. Uh, but uh, thinking that if I said it wasn't me standing in front of Barnett, it was God, they'd say, oh, that proves he's crazy. <laughs> so, but now I guess I don't care. I really thought I couldn't die. I, that, you know, how uh, anybody could have thought realistically what I thought. I really did. I really thought it. I mean, uh, I really thought I couldn't die. Not only that, I thought I could, if a mob came after me, I thought all I had to do was raise my hand. I mean, uh, uh, and believed it. I mean, they, uh, and now I'm at peace with it because I realized most of the things I did in Mississippi, if I hadn't believed I couldn't die, if I hadn't believed I had all this magical power, I wouldn't have done it. So, uh, uh, so in that regard, I have no regrets. The biggest thing about all the pictures, every one of them look almost exactly the same. Does it, does it bring back memories? things that you don't normally think of? Like if you see a photo, do you think of something that you hadn't thought of in, in so many years? Or, Well, to tell the truth, I mean, uh, in the military, we used to have old saying that old, somebody's old unconscious. I mean, uh, 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 that would be something like kamikaze power. Uh, it's almost like, uh, you, but, 20, 25 years, you can live somewhere and pass a certain street every day, but when somebody asks you where that street is, you don't remember ever seeing it. There was not one person that I could ever have identified if I'd met him uh, anywhere. I, I, no student, no teacher, nobody. I mean, I didn't see anything. I mean, they, uh, and it's even, it's not easy now for me to understand. I mean, uh, but when I look at those pictures, I can understand why. Because, I mean, I obviously was not in tune with nothing that was going on. I understand clearly the nonviolence thing, and actually I saw Martin Luther King only three or four times, and every time I questioned him about this nonviolent thing, he completely convinced me it was a tactic. I mean that, uh, but uh, it was to me violence and the use of violence is the most fundamental of all American rights. And to give that up for any reason damages any particular, any future. Actually, uh, the only way any people in the history of Western Christian civilization have ever moved up in a society is through their military participation. And the, uh, my greatest fear about the nonviolent idea was that it would eventually create a mindset where blacks wouldn't want to do their part in defending America.